She was awesome. Mm -hmm. she was were you at least happy about that? I hope. Yeah. Uh, I'm not. Yeah, a, I'm no, not a huge Lady Gaga no. fan, uh, but boy, she the energy was amazing. Really she just had amazing. a hip replacement surgery. Yeah. And really? she was, I know, and I kept saying, "Don't fall, lady, don't fall." She was yeah. so awesome. Though. She, she, she came out of the roof of the show. It was very cool, very nice. Yeah, and very positive. And then the second half came and it kind of ruined the whole thing. And they were like, "This is going to be it's all over." But weatherwise, beautiful day. It was. We made it into the 50s. We get into the 60s tomorrow, but we're also tracking two rounds of thunderstorms and the risk for severe weather over the next couple of uh, uh, the next 24 hours, I should say. Damaging wind, large hail, heavy rain, lightning, all are threats with the storms as they develop. No storms right now, but this is live Doppler 13 radar, and we are tracking some rain. Mentioned Highway 52 last time around. It's now working its way across the northern half of Franklin County now. As this tracks north and east, Liberty, it is moving your way, so a brief downpour. Scattered showers around the Indianapolis area, and a little bit of rain now entering Anderson. So southern half of Madison County provided this holds together. Muncie and Hartford City, some rain headed your way. And we are forecasting these to become more numerous over the next few hours. You can see the lens of our camera over downtown. A few drops on it. 48 degrees in the capital city. Winds are south southeast at 8 miles per hour. Everything tracking from southwest to northeast. And again, forecast to become more numerous over the next few hours. When you join us at 11 o'clock tonight, we may have a couple of thunderstorms forming across the southern part of the state. There will be pockets of heavy rain embedded in the rain. A few thunderstorms may be producing some hail after midnight through the early part of tomorrow. That's 3 a.m. with Future Track 13. We'll stop it again at 7 a.m. Steady rain uh, across central Indiana. And then we will wait on a line of thunderstorms. Storms. Mention those two rounds, the first impacting central Indiana tonight with that risk for severe weather across the southwestern part of the state at a two for tonight. That expands and covers the southern half of the state during the day tomorrow. Your Tuesday planner temperatures in the upper 50s and low 60s, but we will be dealing with a line of storms. Now to the timeline. This is Future Track 13, 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. There will be some wet roads for the Tuesday morning drive. That line of storm starts to form mid morning. That's 9 a.m., then quickly makes its way into the central part of the state by midday. With this line of thunderstorms, heavy rain, lots of lightning, and maybe some damaging winds should clear the state by late afternoon, early evening. And then we turn our attention from storms and 60s to snow chances by the middle part of the week. Yes, that's Wednesday with snow arriving. It is an interesting seven-day forecast. Temperatures tomorrow in the upper 50s and low 60s. Rain and storms after midnight. The threat for hail with that line tomorrow. The threat for damaging winds. Heavy downpours of rain and lightning too. Turns snowy with maybe some slushy accumulations on Wednesday, 35. Cold Thursday, 28. But a rebound on the way for Friday and the upcoming weekend. In fact, the 60s are back with rain chances returning this weekend.